Hey guys, what is up? It is Lake here coming at you with another video. Now today I'm going to be showing you a um, just a cool um, application on Windows for your iOS devices. Now um, this is just an iPhone 4 that I have hooked up for it. Um, I do have the 6S Plus, but I didn't want to, I don't know if there's any like types of um, serial numbers that will show up in the points of this video where this old iPhone 4 I could care less about. So let's get right into it. So first, let's start off with the file browser. Now you don't have to be jailbroken for this, but my iPhone 4 has always been jailbroken, so I do have Cydia. But as you can see, um, um, like I said, you don't need Cydia or to be jailbroken at all, just um, to have your iOS device. Now, as you can see, there is a lot of things you can do. Managing app data, what you can do is you can install an IPA. So say you have a um, IPA such as that's uh, an IPSW like Spotify here you could install this IPA and then um, just actually select it and then it would be uploading and then basically what it's going to do is install the IPA on your iOS device um, so this would be useful if you're going to I don't know say download uh, IPAs offline if there's not an app on the App Store that you want. Um, you can restore IPAs, so bring in IPAs from before. You can um, install enterprise sign IPAs, so such as like um, VShare and all those type of like kind of crack apps that you can download offline. So um, basically, I'll just show you the process of this. Um, this is a really cool application. Um, Basically, if you've never heard of this Spotify app, it's just kind of like a, it's like a kind of, not cracked, but a version without ads, um, which is really nice to have sometimes if you just want no ads and all that stuff, so it's really nice, um, but um, it's really useful, so uh, I'm just going to cancel that for now. Um, but let's get right into the next step. Now, the next uh, not step uh, feature, um, there is the iPhone Box App Store, which has a bunch of apps that are supported on the iPhone and that are not. Um, so basically, you can get all these apps for free. Um, all of them are pretty much free anyway, but uh, it's just really cool that you can get all these apps just from this App Store um, and using the install IPA it's really nice um, now you can see in the file browser you can browse user applications um, you can browse photos and all that good stuff so as you can see if we click here we can SSH into the iPhone um, SSH terminal um, so let's see if this loads up I don't know if it will I've never actually tested or used this feature um, I'll just X this out um, but you SSH USB tunnel um, also check photos and how many photos so that's why you can check videos music um, ringtones you can add ringtones as you can see you can import um, you can import music you can um, import video and as you guessed you can import or export all of these um, photos or any of these import export and I think even a uh, there's no that's it import export um, but yeah, it's a really great application. You should go and check it out. A lot of cool things on this app and very useful for people that even aren't jailbroken that just want the actual application. So thanks for watching, guys. Please rate, comment, like, subscribe. I'm sorry for my little lower voice. Yet again, it is another late night video. But thanks for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed this and will take use to this. And uh, yeah, so I'll see you in my next video, guys. Peace out.